Everyone, welcome back to Femacy Lighthouse. Thank you so much for being here with me once more on my channel to book a private one-on-one -on -one session with me. All of that info can be found in the description box below of this video. I encourage everyone to join me at the Private Lighthouse on Instagram. That is my new broadcast channel. The link for you to join the Private Lighthouse will be in the comment section. The moon is in Scorpio today. Let's get started. Spirit, please speak to me. All right, so we have an energy coming out here right away. I am just tired of seeing this card. No, I do not feel like this is Taurus. All right, somebody is overstimulated. They keep overthinking something. There's a lot on their mind. They need somebody to talk to. Something like that is going on with this energy. I feel like there's somebody really controlling around them. And the person that's trying to control this person that feels stuck is doing it because they feel like they have the right to. And let me give you an example of why someone would feel like they have the right to control you. If you let somebody pay for everything and if you let somebody give you everything that you want, right? Because sometimes people want to buy me things. And I'm like, no, I can buy my own CC bag. I don't need you to buy it for me. And they'll be like, well, can I pay one of your bills? No, I'm good. You know what I'm saying? If you allow people to keep paying for things, then they feel like they control you or that they can control you and that they can tell you whatever they want to tell you and that you're just going to have to keep your mouth shut because if it's not for this bread that they're putting on the table, then if they take it away, that's how they feel like you belong to them or that they have authority over you. So someone feels like they control someone else right now because of everything that they have given to them. And if you keep allowing someone to pay for everything and to, uh, oh no, I got it. No, we'll do it under my name. Well, that's a way that they control you. And sometimes people don't pick up on it, right? Because they're going to throw it in your face. The moment that you do something wrong to someone who you allow to pay for absolutely everything, they're going to be like, oh, if it wasn't for me, you wouldn't have this. And if it wasn't for me, I'm the one who bought that bag and I'm the one who da 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 da. Nah, that's why I'd be like, no, I can pay for that. When we get to know each other a little bit better, then we'll talk about assets for right now. We're just going to, you do you and I do me type of energy, okay? Because somebody feels that just because they're paying for everything, that they control somebody right now. Tell me more. Talk to me about this energy. Knight of Swords, yeah. Somebody keeps getting on this person and I don't know who it is. It's like this person is throwing it in their face. If it wasn't for me, you wouldn't have this. If it wasn't for me, you wouldn't have that car. If it wasn't for me, you wouldn't have this house. If it was, that's what I'm hearing. Okay? And sometimes there are men and women that will do this. They'll pay for everything. They'll, I'm going to do this. I'm going to get you that. Because they're going to feel like at the end of the day, you're going to do whatever they want. Because they're paying for your car insurance and they're paying for your bills and they're paying for the mortgage. And so they feel like you have to keep your mouth shut. Nah. So I feel like there's somebody here that's not having it. Okay. And someone would rather be independent than to be with someone that's acting like their mommy or something like that or daddy. So there's something like that happening here. Tell me more. We have a lot of Libra, Gemini, Aquarius coming out here first. Talk to me. We have the Nine of Pentacles, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. We have this Ace of Wands to the Nine of Pentacles. I feel like you don't want no parts of what's going on over there. You already feel what's going on over there with whomever it is. You're feeling the tension already. This person wants to talk to you about what's going on. Now, this could be your sister, your brother, and I feel like you told them this already. Didn't you tell your sister, your brother, or your niece, whomever? And they wasn't listening, but now they're starting to feel the effects of everything that you told them. So 
I feel them trying to speak to you, but I feel like you're really independent right now. And I don't know if you want to entertain a conversation with them. They do want to speak to you. This is fire, right? To this earth energy that's independent. This is somebody that's single or that operates like they are their own boss, all right? So you could be an entrepreneur, you could work for yourself. Even if you don't work for yourself, you carry yourself well. Like you don't need the group of, around you. Like you don't need the pack. You don't need any of those people. They know that about you, all right? Tell me more about what's going on here. Virgo energy, tell me more. The lovers, the wheel of fortune. So what's the problem here? Someone trying to revive a situation, the magician, the judgment. Five of pentacles though. Somebody's complaining. I just hear somebody complaining. Somebody around this person keeps complaining. And then this person goes and they, they start calling everybody and, and talking about this shit. Why? Why? The reason why they're doing it is because they're looking for counsel. That's why. They're looking for someone to be on their side. They're looking for someone to understand what's happening to them. But this person needs to understand that they can't control people with money. What's wrong with them? That's how they manipulate people, by the way. It's like, I'm going to give you this bag. All right? And... You want me to pay for that tomorrow? Oh, I got you. Yeah, I bought this. I bought that. Yeah, that's how they try to trap you. That's how they make you always run back to them because they feel like you can't do it without them. Don't allow someone like that to do it to you. That's why when someone be like, oh, I'm going to pay for this for you, I'll be like, nah, take your bag. I don't care what you drive. I don't care where you live. Take your bag. I'm fine. I have my own. I have my own car to drive. I don't need your car. I don't care how fancy it is. I don't care how fancy your house is. If I'm not feeling you, I can't. I'm sorry. I've never been anyone to be with the money like this. I can't do that. I, I not me. There's other people that into that. I don't. I don't do that. That's not me. Okay. And I just feel like. That's how someone likes to control this person, whomever this is. It's by paying for everything. Tell me more. Eight of Cups, Page of Swords. I don't know, Taurus. Like, are you leaving this person? Because you keep leaving every reading for the past week. <laughs> This is you, Eight of Cups, leaving a situation. And it's like you have your watcher, Page of Swords, watching the Eight of Cups. Nine of Cups is like they desire you, but they still in a situation with somebody who's pissed off at them because they're changing and they're switching it up. All right, they're switching it up. That's what I'm hearing. And there's a lot of nagging coming from someone that's associated with this person that's fixated on you. And I feel like this person is constantly talking to the family members and fucking making shit worse because they're looking for counsel and they're looking for someone to understand where they're coming from. Something like that is happening with this person. Emperor, Energy, Aries, Three of Cups. There's a third party situation for sure. We do have Capricorn coming out here. Two of Cups, yeah. Look, I just feel here with this person right here, if you want to deal with them, you can if you want to, but I feel like who would want to be in a situation like that, right? They got drama over there. Somebody got drama. I feel like you're good right now where you are. All right? Like... I don't know what type of apology they need to give you, but I'm not sure. I'm not sure if you're going to accept it or not. Um, there could be a fear on their behalf of you rejecting the apology or something like that. I feel like someone wants to apologize. I do feel that. So it's up to you. It really is. 
at this point because I feel like you're doing well. Um, you don't need anybody to do anything for you at this point. You do it for yourself. But someone is kind of like antagonizing this person is what I'm getting in the present moment. And I don't feel like it's you. It's an outside source. Maybe this person lives with their mom or something and their mom is getting on them about like, I'm the one who pays for everything here. And if it wasn't for me, I just keep hearing, if it wasn't for me, you wouldn't have this, that, all of that. And somebody is humiliated by it. So that could be happening as well. Talk to me about the future when it comes to this connection. The future. Five of Swords. Strength Energy. Three of Cups. Like, how we get the Three of Cups two times? Who else is this person talking to? complicating their life more they want to speak to you i feel like they need to apologize to you i don't know if they're actually going to do that because for some reason they're intimidated to approach you and then they're dealing with other people to distract themselves all of these people for what why i don't get it they're making their life more complicated than it needs to be communication about what Communication about some secret. I don't know what's going on with this person, Taurus, but it just seems like they have like too many issues right now with more than one person. And they keep involving themselves with other energies because of the main problem that they're having with this person that wants to control them. It feels like Saturn energy. It does. It feels like somebody who's very strict, somebody who wants things to happen their way. But again, this person is entitled because they feel like they can be because they gave this person everything. And I feel like they're throwing it in their face. They're throwing it in their face is what I'm getting. So anything else? What else? Does Taurus need to know about this situation, please? What else does Taurus need to know about this situation? Yeah. The doctor, again. How many times has this come out? It's like they need to see the therapist or talk to somebody. Maybe they view you as a therapist. Do they have access to you anymore? Why don't they have access to you anymore? What did they do? The fear. I know there's some sort of fear that they have to come towards you. I feel like they're really emotional at this time. They need healing. We have a storm going on. I knew it. I knew it. There's something here going on with this person. And it's like, perhaps you don't even want to get involved because you already know, like, there's a lot going on. There are other energies. So I feel like you're not the only one and you know that. They keep involving themselves with so many people. And it's like, you're making your life worse by doing that. Why would you just give your energy away to several people at one time? Like, why? I don't get it with this person. Energy is sacred. Somebody is a hoe. Who is a hoe here? Like, that's what this is giving. I don't know. Let's see what happens tomorrow. To book a private session, all of that info is below. Take care.